Hey guys, it's Saturday. Guess what that means? Half off at the thrift store. And I think this is the mother load. If you haven't noticed, yes, my hair is lighter. She was supposed to get it all to match this. But it didn't want to, the color didn't want to strip out. So this is what we ended up with, which I hate. But rather than dye it dark again, I'm going to live with it. Because you can see underneath where, I mean, my goal is to get to that. So anyway, that's that. That's the rest of the story. All right, let's get started. So half off day, this was two dollars and it's super cute i'll probably sell this for twelve dollars in the booth these were pretty much a steal they were a dollar fifty a piece and there's three of them so i'll probably sell them thirty dollars for the set hey Where's the rest of the stuff? No, it's got to come in here. <laughs> it's okay. it's just kind of thought we had a lot already in here. Oh, that's all right. Just bring it in. I would appreciate it. They would appreciate it. Okay. Here we go. This is a planter. And two dollars. Once this is painted up, twelve bucks. This is just dressed back really nice. Look at all the texture. That's going to be actually really cool. I got this planter. This one was $2.50. This one's a, got a lot more detail on it. This little basket, which I thought was real cute, 50 cents. This is a kind of a nice basket. Honey was like, ew, it looks like it has toothpaste or something in it. And it probably does. But I'm the, the thrift store cleaning person stuff, so this was $2. And it's nice because it has wood at the bottom. So I think um, somebody will definitely pay $10 for that. I don't have to do anything but clean it. Look at this, $2. I have never found anything with a cloche, so I was super excited to find this. Look at this, isn't that cute? Oh my gosh, so cute. Um, so this was $3.50, and I'll sell this probably for $12. This was 99 cents, and I'll paint that up. This was $3.49. This one was not on sale, but I'm sure I'll sell this for $10 or $12. Look what he just brought. Look at how big this is. This. It's the roadmap to my life. This was $4. $4. <laughs> and I'm going to paint it, and then I'm going to put a transfer on it. Somebody will use it for decor in our house. And we'll sell it for 50 bucks. There you go. All right. That's heavy, isn't it? It is. Surprisingly heavy. Right. Okay. I thought there was a bundle of cash in the bottom of it. <laughs> oh my gosh, this is really heavy. Okay. So this was full price. This was $10. But I thought it was super cute and could sit on somebody's you know, sideboard or whatever. It's very farmhouse looking and I will make it even more farmhouse looking. So that was $10 and when I'm done with it, I'll probably sell it for 50 bucks, 50, 60 bucks. Uh, so there's this, which I really like the design of this and I'm gonna paint it and I'll probably do a stencil on it. Um, how much was this? So this was $3.50, and when I'm done with it, I'll probably sell it for $25. And I actually love this piece. He loves this. He loves it. This is a very beautiful piece. Show him. Ah, honey, don't focus it. Okay, so this, uh, <laughs> this oak table 
got it for eight dollars and fifty cents. And it's sturdy. It doesn't need any repair. It's this is not fake anything. This is solid wood. Yeah. Eight dollars and fifty cents. So when we're done with that. <coughs> I don't know, it depends what we do to it, but at least $60. He's making a face. <laughs> He's making a face like Mark. Okay. Oh. I love these, okay? I don't know if I'm crazy, but I love this in the bathroom with magazines. I don't hang out in the bathroom. But I know somebody who does. And it's nice to have the magazines there. Obviously, this is really old school. I'm going to paint it and make it more farmhousey. But that may actually stay. We'll see. We'll see. I have a hard time keeping things. Oh, here's the man. Okay, so this is like a, an, an old hamper. Yeah. And it's in really good condition. It opens on the top. How much was that? Uh, it says $8.99, but it was half off, so it was $4.50. Uh, but I think these are kind of neat. I mean, I'm not a big fan of using these for a hamper, but you could most certainly use it for like a potato bin. Um, or we could even put a, another door in it to do an onion potato bin. Or who knows? How about we just paint it up the way it is and sell it like that? And they can do whatever they want with it. I'm down. And he's down. Okay. All right. Just a few more things. I mean, to me, this feels like a mother load. But I know people like Jamie Ray who buy a lot more than this. But I went to two ARC thrift stores today. This was the first thing Honey eyeballed, and he said he loved it. Look at this. So this was on sale for $3, and that will definitely get a paint job. And, and, and the reason why I like it, and I, I'm a clock guy, and I think clocks are, are mesmerizing. I think they're beautiful, and and I, I really like all the, de the, all the detail in this. So that's going to be a real pretty paint of that. You're going to let me paint it? <laughs> so I got these two um, large mouth ball jars and these were 99 cents. I kind of collect these so that I can have this guy make little crates. Um, we put one of those little crates in the, in our booth and it sold the next day. So um, Then there's this nice farmhouse type basket. And this was three dollars and fifty cents, and we'll sell this for fifteen dollars. And it would be really nice to, you know, pick up apples, oranges, peaches, um, <laughs> wearing a sundress. <laughs> <laughs> All right. But you'll never catch me in a sundress. Just so you know. Really? <laughs> All right, don't go away, honey. Don't go away. Okay, so I picked this up. And this is getting gone, but I liked it because it was all, it already has the hanger on the back, and it was $2. So you're and just going more after the canvas. I could, yeah, I could put a new, I could put a new sign on there. Here's the curtain. So, don't know if he's going to like this clock, but I did go ahead and pick it up and thought I'll paint the outside yellow and distress back the the copper. I so, think it's kind of cool. Somebody will like it. And then I, we've already done one like this before and it sold really quick. Oh yeah, nice spot. So this one was a dollar fifty. And this will sell for twelve dollars. And this one was a dollar fifty and this one will sell for twelve or fifteen. Probably 15 because it's got flowers on it. All right. I think that is it. So I hope you enjoyed our haul today. I'm going to be busy painting, painting, painting all day tomorrow and most of the day Monday. 
We do have a trip to make to the brass armadillo, so we're gonna go over there in the morning, and then I'm gonna come back and paint this stuff. So, we've got more stuff to show you coming up when we get this stuff painted. I will try to remember this time to actually do a video before we haul it off to the yeah. antique mall. Because right now we are in overload. Overload. Yeah, he doesn't like it when it's like this. Well, I'd, 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 I would rather be like this than I'd rather be like <laughs> <laughs> I'd rather be like this than um, bare naked. But, oh, he doesn't mean like us bare naked. That would be really bad. Well, he wouldn't be so bad, but anyway, <laughs> we're going to go to dinner. Well, we're going to pick it up and bring it home yeah. because there's a lot of stuff going on in Denver that we don't want to be a part of. So we're yeah, going to go pick up. I didn't want to go anyway. there. We're going to go get our food, come home, and hunker down. All right. Talk to you guys soon. Okay. Be careful. Bye.